He was a happy-go-lucky dog. You know, at home, he was part of the family. You know, my, my wife and my son were able to be around him. He was, you know, my best buddy and pal. You know, he could be out with us in the yard if we were cooking out, and I didn't have to worry about him. But when it was time to come to work, Krieger knew. It was like a light switch flipped. You know, he got loaded up in that truck, and it was time to go to work. On January the 11th, uh, my partner Krieger and I were, were dispatched to assist our SWAT unit with the hostage barricade situation. Norfolk police say they were met by a woman upon arrival who told them her husband held her at gunpoint. The subject came out of the house and was armed with a, a handgun. Uh, the subject came dangerously close to our position and I made the decision to deploy my partner and attempt to resolve the situation without deadly force. It very well could have resulted in uh, Ryan or either the, the, other, the other SWAT officers to be injured. And because he was able to deploy his dog, there was a very good chance that that did not occur. And my partner Krieger made the apprehension, um, keeping myself and the members of the SWAT team safe so that we could attempt to get the subject in custody. While my partner Krieger was struggling with the suspect, the suspect was able to fire two rounds, striking my partner in the side, uh, ultimately uh, killing him. He was a great partner. Seeing what Ryan and Krieger did on that particular day, it was just a cut above. The perfect handler and a perfect dog on that day possibly prevent officers from getting injured. That's why I thought it was very important to nominate him for the Valor Award. I'm very proud of Krieger. Um, Krieger never showed any hesitation no matter what the task was, you know. Uh, he constantly surprised me, constantly doing things that even I wasn't sure he would be able to do. And uh, he never let me down, not once. It's my honor and privilege today to introduce Officer Ryan McNiff, who will be receiving an award today for his K-9 Krieger, who was recently killed in the line of duty. Thank you.